Assalamu alaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. In today's video, I am going to be reviewing and demoing for you the Christmas sweater bath bomb from Lush. So let's get started. So the Christmas sweater is quite a charming bath bomb thanks to its very cute design. It's mostly red all over. Then it has these two white designs. I did not know what they were. But then on closer inspection, you can see that these are two white reindeers on top. I thought it was snowflakes, but no, the snowflakes are near the reindeer's head. Now, it is Christmas sweater bath bomb. Since it's a British company, I thought they would name it Christmas jumper. So this is Lush's Christmas range product on their website. It is mentioning it has a very Christmassy scent, whatever that is, never experienced it. So it contains ginger powder, mustard powder, coriander seed oil, and clove bud oil. All of these ingredients we'll talk in detail later on. Looking at the ingredients, I feel like the scent is going to be uh, very spicy, very warming with a slight hint of zesty sweetness because of the inclusion of Sicilian lemon oil. Looking at all the ingredients, I think this bath bomb not only will warm you up on a very cold winter's day, but on Lush's website, it is mentioning that it is perfect for helping to ease sore muscles, aches, and pains. Ugly Christmas sweaters are the norm these days, but there's nothing unsightly about this festive fizzer. Drop it into the bathtub and watch as the magical display of swirling colors brings the water to life. You'll be snug as a bug in a rug when you dip into a warming blend of spicy clove bud, refreshing coriander seed, and cleansing Sicilian lemon oils. Christmas has never been so cozy. This bath bomb is like you're drinking hot chocolate near a fireplace. So this is Christmas sweater bath bomb from Lush's website, Netherlands edition. It's getting hot in here, so take off all your Christmas jumpers. How many are you wearing? and socks and jump into a steamy bath. After a busy day of shopping and carrying around all those presents, drop this hot and spicy bomb into the water for some physiotherapy. Sicilian lemon oil with mustard and ginger powders will ease muscles and warm you to your soul. Coriander seed and clove bud oils are sure to spice up your life. So they have included three main ingredients false stimulating and astringent which is ginger powder spicy and stimulating which is the clove oil and deodorizing and energizing is the coriander seed oil then we have the description of the christmas sweater bath bomb from lush's website french edition it's rather hot in here so take off your sweater and try on another one in the form of a bath bomb after spending the day going from boutique to boutique Shopping for your Christmas presents, take advantage of this warm and spicy bath bomb for a well-deserved break. Sicilian lemon essential oil and mustard and ginger powders relax the muscles and warm the heart. Add a spicy edge to your life and turn heads with coriander seed oil and clove oil. This clove oil, now it is spicy and stimulating. Lush has used clove bud oil, ooh, okay, clove bud oil to create warming perfume blends and for its stimulating effect on the skin, effects on the skin. It can also be used to freshen breath in solid toothpaste and Lush uses it in their henna hair dyes for its scent and for its stimulating effect on the scalp. This essential oil is extracted through steam distillation from the aromatic flower buds of an evergreen tree belonging to the Myrtle family. Spicy and sweet scented clove adds a warming note to perfume blends and has stimulating effects on the skin. Its chemical constituents include eugenol, making it ideal for soothing the entire mouth and freshened breath. Cloves are the dried aromatic flower buds of a tropical evergreen tree of the myrtle family. They are picked before the blossoms open and the buds are dried and change color from rose to brown. They are then put through a process of steam distillation producing an essential oil that has a warm, rich, spicy, and sweet aroma. To create clove powder, the dried buds are ground down into a fine powder. Cloves can boost circulation and are also known to be antifungal and antiseptic, which makes them ideal in products for feet. For feet? I thought it was for teeth. Okay, oh well. 
The main constituents of clove but essential oil is a spicy aromatic substance called eugenol. Like most things spicy, it stimulates the blood flow which will which revives the skin and promotes healthy hair growth. But this compound has also shown good results at fighting against hair loss and dandruff. It is used in oral care products. It freshens the breath and, thanks to its analgesic properties, soothes the entire mouth. Next up, the ingredient is ginger powder. Ginger stimulates the circulation, eases aches and pains, relaxes tense muscles, and alleviates the symptoms of colds, coughs, and flu. Ginger root is the edible part of the ginger plant. It's the root that is used in food, medicine, and cosmetics. Now, the ginger root is a rhizome. Is a rhizome? Is a rhizome, which means that it grows horizontally underground. Yeah, we studied this. These are harvested and used fresh to obtain the essential oil or absolute, or dried and ground into a powder which has a strong flavor than the fresh root. Ginger contains substances which are very antibacterial and anti-inflammatory. For this reason, it has been used for centuries to treat all sorts of aches. And ginger powder is spice up your life. They have used, Lush has used powdered ginger products for its astringent cleansing and warming effects. It soothes aching joints and relaxes ten, tense muscles. Ginger root is the edible part of the ginger plant which thrives in warm and humid climates. It has been prized as a wonder ingredient. Dried and powdered ginger root is said to be hotter than the fresh root. The next ingredient is mustard powder. Yes, mustard powder contains curcumin, all these words. A yellow pigment which is said to have antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. It also stimulates circulation and relaxes the muscles. Now, mustard seeds are the small round seeds of mustard plants. They take up to 10 days to germinate and mature mustard plants grow into shrubs. Mustard seeds are a rich source of oil and protein as well as the antioxidant cysteine which is said to aid the treatment of arthritis and other inflammatory conditions. Okay, coriander seed oil is deodorizing and stimulating. It has a very sweet, spicy, strong and woody aroma. Lush uses it in products for its fragrance and for its deodorizing and stimulating properties, as mentioned earlier. It uplifts and refreshes. It's also helpful in chilly conditions for warming tired muscles. Coriander is a member of the carrot family. Its leaves are feathery and it bears purple-tinged or white flowers and small green seeds. The pale-colored oil is steam distilled from these seeds. As mentioned before, coriander has a sweet, spicy, strong and woody aroma. It is known for its stimulating and warming effect on the mind and on the blood flow. It also has an analgesic effect on the muscles. More information on the coriander seed oil. The ancient Egyptians called coriander the spice of happiness because of its uplifting and anti-fatigue effect on the mind and used it as an aphrodisiac. Again, that word, sakfarla. It was also referred to as an aphrodisiac in the Arabian fantasy 1001 Nights. Uh, what's that? And as you can see, there is something shining. So they do have silver luster in it. It just adds a little sparkle. Now, luster gives the Lush products a whimsical touch and leaves a gorgeous, delicate glimmer on the skin. Now, they have mentioned that the lusters are made from natural minerals. They create a little shine wherever they go, but won't damage the environment one bit. This is... Lush's claim. They use lusters and glitters to create a shimmering effect in the bath water and on the skin, adding a visual experience element to your personal care routine. On Lush's website, it's mentioning any product that uses this luster. Uh, these are compounds made from food grade minerals and natural materials, and they're not harmful to the environment. So everyone, if you really enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press that bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post, leave a constructive comment, and share this video. I know, I know, it's a lot to do, but I'll really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah Hafiz. Bye. Jazakallah khair, thank you so much for watching till the end of this video. If you want to watch similar videos, please check out the playlist right here.
Check it out.